St. Lucia is in the process of sending a team to compete in a motor racing event in Antigua later this year. The St. Lucia Motorsports Association, along with the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, under its alternative sports program, invited a number of car enthusiasts for a qualifier event recently to select four drivers to represent the island at the competition. Um, this is the first time that we're actually going over to Antigua as a, to represent the country and not as individuals. So it is something that we, we you know, would, are hoping to continue um, and not just fall back on after, after this year. We're hoping for more vehicles, but um, as, it's, as it is, as life happens, is, there are things that happen. Um, cars is a mechanical, is a mechanical um, instrument. So, um, some of them break, some of them work, um, some of them were in body shops um, and, and some of them are waiting parts um, and we couldn't wait any longer um, because we need to give the, the participants who are going to be chosen the time frame in which to prepare the cars for the event. President of the St. Lucia Motorsports Association, Terrell Compton, was pleased with the initiative that involved drivers from various clubs and some that were not aligned. We had to see where our drivers are and of course inform them of the standards that they need to meet. So today was qualifying based on time. Then now we have to qualify based on the categories in which they're going to run. Whether it be the 10 second bracket, whether it be the 9 second bracket, the 11 second bracket. These are the areas that we are aiming to have representatives and even in the 12 second bracket. And it means that Data collection is taking place, and so a number of key dragsters were given the opportunity from different clubs, and those who are not aligned with clubs but have the passion of racing were also called out uh, to come and show their stuff. Four drivers were selected after the qualifiers to represent St. Lucia at the Antigua event, scheduled to take place in November this year. They are Eddie Legrand, Ronald Logis, Ken Joseph and Johnny Chitoli. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.